My name is Brandon Sparks. I'm from Michigan, and I'm the director of rugby here for the Utah Warriors. I played football through high school. Once I got to senior high school, I realized genetically I wasn't as gifted, which allowed me to play rugby uh, more and more through college. And it was fortunate enough to spend about 12 years bumming around the world, playing for different teams and experiencing different cultures, which really set me up for success when I came back to America and applied that knowledge and experience to American rugby to help grow the sport here in the States. The uh, men and women's age grade pathway for the national team for the USA. University of Michigan, I also founded the Legacy Rugby Academy in Michigan that was focused on developing athletes to prepare them for the next level of rugby, which I don't feel there's enough academies in America really focused on that goal for players. I've really just experienced rugby all over, played with Palo Alto in Northern California, and I'm a referee. so. to create a comprehensive pathway from high school, college, club, all the way up to the MLR side with clearly defined goals for players around skill set and physical attributes needed to be successful at the next level. And then we've also got a great scouting network set up where we're able to ID players from around the country, both in club, college, and high school, so we can build out a comprehensive database on the talent that's offered here in America. Because America has an amazing pool of rugby talent that hasn't been utilized, scouted, or maximized yet in, in, in our league and then at the national team level as well. So here in Utah, I'm looking to maximize the local talent because I believe it's the best in the country anywhere. At the high school level, we want to make sure that we're working with both the players and the coaches to help develop them and their curriculum and their content. So that playing skill level, that gap doesn't exist when they go to college. At the college level, we really want to make sure that we're maximizing our local scouting network to identify the talent that's already here in Utah to hopefully get them into our selects program. And our selects program is really focuses on preparing the the next wave of MLR players and the future stars for the Utah Warriors. Because I believe that America has enough athletic talent quantity wise that we can be really successful at the international level. We just really need to focus on the fundamentals and making sure that our coaches and our local communities have those resources to pass on to those players so then those players can be successful when it's time for them to step up into that next level of rugby. If you want it at the easiest level, I handle everything up to the sidelines and the coaching duties of the MLR. So I'm responsible for the build out of the pathway, junior warriors content creation, brand management in the community, the rugby community specifically, the talent identification both globally and domestically, and then the relationship management with our local shareholders here in the state, as well as nationally, and then even globally with the agents and other teams that we're in constant and frequent contact with. After the intense conversation with Kimball over several months, I felt like this was the best area in our country to be at, to be successful with the local rugby community and transitioning them to the MR level, our level because Utah has phenomenal rugby at the club, college, and high school level, which we can really maximize to make us a championship program. The coach education and the accessibility that our community will have with us to make sure that we can give back and help support them to achieve their goals both locally and at the national level and even at the player level we would love to be able to work with those players prepare them for international rugby uh, at the age grade or even at the adult level so spend time with my beautiful wife and daughter who are my world uh, I like jiu-jitsu, I'm a purple belt, and I've been a practicer for over 10 years. And I love scuba diving anywhere and everywhere, especially if it's warm. I'm an international award-winning stage actor and director for the International uh, Thespian Society. And my wife and I adopt elderly English Bulldogs to give them a good end of life, which is extremely emotional stress on me, but my wife is awesome at it.